What's up guys, it's Ed from TechSource and I have a special video for you guys today. So my good friend Peter actually has a new modded PC desk and I'm going to be going through some of his previous work and also showcase the brand new one he built recently. Let's go and start. So this is Peter's most recent creation and it's called the TT Desk, which is an old glass open air style PC. The main difference between this desk PC and the rest of them is that this one is split into two sides, leaving the middle portion open. I honestly like this one a lot better because you don't have the keyboard, mouse, and monitor resting on top of the desk blocking the view of the components. At least this way the parts are more visible. On one side we have the 6700K processor, two ASUS GTX 980 Strix graphics cards, and 16 gigs of Evixer Tesla RAM with the electric style LEDs. On the other side is where the reservoir and pumps are located along with the second radiator. Honestly though, the thing that really made this setup complete was the badass ROG logo that illuminated through the glass desk from the ROG ultrawide monitor. I can without a doubt say that this is the best PC desk that I've ever seen on the channel, but we're not done here guys, we're just warming up. Next up we have Cross, which was one of Peter's earliest creations. This is essentially two PCs in one desk since we do have two separate motherboards and GPUs. I don't have the specs for this build, so instead we can just drool at these high resolution photos. It also appears that the RAM sticks are water cooled, and it's safe to assume that anything that is able to overclock is most likely overclocked. In terms of storage, there actually doesn't seem to be a lot of space, just a lot of smaller capacity SSDs which are most likely in a RAID configuration, my guess would be for aesthetic reasons. I also like how conveniently placed the knobs are to control the pump speed off to the right side. At number 3 we have something very familiar. This is the same desk that was featured in Setup Wars episode 53. This is the black and neon green themed desk mod running a 5960X and two GTX 980s in SLI. This is definitely one of those builds that look a lot cooler at night. So this is what I was talking about earlier guys, the keyboard and mouse are pretty much blocking the view of the components inside, which is why I much prefer the previous layout as there aren't that many things in the way. And finally we have the Razer Desk which is another black and neon green themed PC. Again I don't have the specs so we can just stare at these pictures with envy. I really like the layout of the reservoirs with the Razer Snake logo on them and it appears that even the hard drives are water cooled because why not? Off to the left side is where the two graphics cards are located which are probably GTX 980s knowing Peter and then we have the storage units right below. A very consistent theme that we have seen across all of Peter's desk mods. Also I'm not too sure what's going on over here on the right side. It appears to be a test bench style setup with a single graphics card. But anyways that is it for this video. You guys can put the tissue paper away and let me know which one of these awesome PC desks was your favorite by dropping a comment down below. I also want to give a huge thanks to Graphic Stock for making this video possible. Graphic Stock has the largest unlimited download of library of graphics, photos, vectors, and images on the internet. If you're a graphic designer, website designer, or even a content creator, then you guys can take advantage of these high resolution graphics. In fact, you guys can try them out for a 7 day free trial by visiting graphicstock.com YouTube or by clicking on the link below. You're actually able to download 140 pieces of content within your free trial and if you guys are happy with the experience, you can sign up to their annual plan for 99 bucks and get unlimited access to over 300,000 plus images. You got nothing to lose since it's a 7 day free trial, so make sure you guys check out the link below if you're interested. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.